Hello everyone, this is Pratip Kumar from Chennai, India. In this video, I am going to show how to install CentOS 7 GNOME Desktop from LiveCD. Uh, I have already created a VM in VMware Workstation 12 version, and um, the VM properties are memory is 2 GB, processor is 2, and hard disk 20 GB, and CD duty I have selected a uh, known disk desktop ISO file so as you can see here live GNOME desktop file ISO file and uh, network character is custom because I'm going I'm providing internet connectivity to this VM so I'm launching this VM now You can press this button to enter full screen mode. In this case, press enter in order to start CentOS without installing. So, once we entered into that uh, live environment, we can start um, CentOS installation. If you want to check something, you can um, proceed on the live environment now you can press escape button to see what are the services are starting behind So now we got our live environment from CentOS 7 GNOME Desktop. So using this icon we can install CentOS 7 into our hard drive. So just skip this. Skip. So this is not a permanent environment this is just a live environment if you reboot all your settings will be deleted so now we are going to install CentOS 7 into our hard drive so just double click this icon it will start the installation setup choose English or else as per your requirement language and press continue um, I'm going to set up automatic partitioning so just click and press done for me this is enough so if you know you can modify the disk configurations and I'm going to set up host name for this VM so click on that and uh, 
www.pylacom.com press apply now you can see that uh, it has been changed press done and click begin installation so set your root password root uh, root account is used for the administering the system so I'm putting the password red hat tab red hat done so I'm going to create a new user called Pradeep P-R-A-D-H-E-P or -E E-D-H-A-T same password or -E E-D-H-A-T done alright so I'm going to pass this video until this uh, process completion so as I expected everything has been successfully completed now I'm going to press this quiet button after that I'm going to restart quiet and click this button press restart So, in license information, tick on I expect I accept the license agreement. Done. And press finish configuration. I'm going to log in as a root so press not listed option and provide username as root next and provide the password red hat sign in So you can see that the icons has been changed. Now in this VM I have installed CentOS 7 GNOME desktop permanently. Skip. Alright, so you can access your application through this module 
I'm just checking my internal connectivity. Hopefully it is working fine, I think. Yes, yes it is. It is working fine. So, thanks for watching.